Clarkson, not particularly happy with that last error. Watch him going out, bang. Little incident early, and that is the hole in the wall. This is quarter time. Chris Scott comes over to the Lions players. And I'm not sure what he was on about here. Danaher has a go. Harris Andrews had a go. Chris Scott points to the other end of the ground. What was he alluding to? Cam Guthrie's in there. It's a 16-point margin in favour of the Cats. Guthrie pulls Scott away. And he looks straight at Andrews. And he said, what happened? Didn't be done. End of story. You're the media journalist, so you figure it out. No, how does it impact <laughs> the club, though? Next question. No, how does it impact Next the question. No, 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 Thanks, Tony. No, no, no. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, mate. Give me a stroke. He's talking about your one-step kick as well. <laughs> Which, that's all you can do. A player. Have a look at this. Yep, loud and clear. <laughs> As Magic hands it back, and uh, Darren Crocker says, oh, "I think, uh, Just the week you've had uh, was it a tough one leading in? They're all tough. Any regrets at all about uh, what oh, happened? I'm sorry, do I, do I need to get a confession? Or something? Last night, I murdered someone. No, not at all. No, I'm just saying. Thank you. Thanks, Mick. He's talking about your one-step kick as well. <laughs> Which, that's all you can do and disappointed that we don't know exactly some of the things that are going on out there. But having said that, uh, the boys had a go. What do you What do you mean? What are you bemused at? What would you think I mean, Richard? What would you really think I mean? So we're, we're going to lose our captain now with a facial break from a uh, uh, to the head. Uh, that's only one instance where we didn't get a free kick. But we just like to think that we get an even play, playing field. Thanks for your time not say a word he is absolutely speechless i boy how the, how they perform and this is when as you're a player you, you're the most nervous because you're never sure what he's going to say here or who he's going to say it to still hasn't spoken yeah, it's interesting uh, not happy with that goal <laughs> <laughs> so marvelously well fresh air shot from the square when he taken the mark oh he didn't like where that the hit zone no, no. you've been Opening us up, causing turmoil within our football club by declaring our team um, well before it needs to be declared. Is that the way Fox want you to oper operate? Yeah, is that what you're doing? Is that the gutter journalist you want to be? No. Is that, is that who you want to be? You let me answer, right? So, yep. So we went in with a plan. We had, we had some late stuff go on with JJ, um, unfortunately, coming out in the warm-up. Everything other than that was according to pl plan from the Sunday, which somehow you've found out about again. So we need to get to the bottom of this. Obviously, we need to put our hand up and, and say that there's, uh, there's some leakage going on, but you're preying on it. And, and it's a team you barrack for. Your conflict of interest here is considerable. And yet your gutter journalism at the moment is killing our, us and behind the scenes. This is why the health and well-being of people in the game is caught up in all this stuff, you know, because we've got things to concentrate performance -wise, concentrate on performance-wise. We've got to look after our own, and then you cause all this um, muckraking trash that happens behind the scenes, and names get brought up into it, and all we're doing is planning for a football game. I can't... Are you proud of yourself? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you're proud of yourself? Yeah, Fox backs me. Wow. Well. And to be honest... To be honest... Today. Today. No, no, selection. no, that's enough. That's enough. Next question, please. Um, yeah, next question. You, you, mate, you're not welcome. No, no, this is the AFL's press conference, and I'll it's sit what? here. It's the what? It's the AFL's press conference. Yeah, OK. Well, well I think you've got enough, boys and girls. For the next question. You got, I think we're probably done, aren't we? OK, so this is what happens, because I know, um, and I know Sam Edmund does it, you know, I know many of you, Riley, I know you'd do it. If you found something out, you'd ring Adrian Shed and say, look, I know this, just so you, you, you know that I know. Um, something's happened, it's got out, and the courtesy and the integrity uh, and the ethical way to go about it has happened in the past. Now, this bloke here, and what he's doing, he's given everyone else a bad name, you know, and, and right where we're trying to stabilise our competition and what we do with everything that's gone behind the scenes and us, you know, as coaches and a football program um, with this, the soft cap situation as it is, 
and and this sort of stuff happens. You're, you're an embarrassment to what you do, mate. You're an embarrassment. God, this is where him watching the play. <laughs> Have a look at this. It was all my... The f***ing spare! Who's f***ing Blake's man? Who is it, Willow? It's, it's Mitch. Come on, Mitch! F***ing work, Mitch! Yes. So is he just not working hard? No. No, he's what? Up the right, okay. No, okay. No, no, no. F***ing run, Will! Right. Give it off quick! Rock it, rock it, rock it. We can't think. We can't think. Sorry, right. Right. Yeah, come, Sorry. On, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Come Fuck on. Fucking Minson again! Fuck him! Right, okay. How long's Minson been on you. for? How long's Minson been on for? Eight minutes, mate. Right, okay, okay. Right. Fucking Fucking thing! Murph coming off, Murph for, uh, yeah, yeah, Mitch, Mitch, Mitch. Okay, now Minson for, um... Fucking get him off. Yeah, um... Get Minson off! He's coming off. Get, get him, him back off. off. Get him off. Get him get off. Get him off. off. Rock it, rock it. We can't hear. We can't fucking hear. Minson, get Minson off. Take Minson off now. Yeah. Fuck you, you big shithead. Fuck you. It's train it and train it and train it. So we'll train it this week and we'll train it the next week and we'll train it the week up and we'll do it for the rest of the year. COVID, we're getting it right. You're walking out of here with one thing on your mind and that is whatever I've been in the past, no longer. I now value defence and I'm going to show it. Have confidence that we've done it before.